we have finally been kicked out of the group chat from my old work. I didn't go on WhatsApp to check that. I had to go on WhatsApp to, like, this on Friday, I had to go on WhatsApp to text my brother, uh, the menu for the chippy so we can decide what he wants. And I saw that they had removed me. Took me a while to do it. <clears throat> um, anyway. I know I'm three weeks late, but that's because my parents had Corona, then I had Corona. But Miss Marvel, mixed ratings, Disney Plus original series, and watch it on Disney Plus. I do not recognize any of this cast, but Imam Falani was great as Miss Marvel. Although I do find it a bit weird that she is currently in the most popular show. Uh, and she has less acting experience than me. I'm not saying that I'm more of an actor than her. It, it's just weird. I also finished Kenobi. But I'm not going to do it that far because I think it's very likely that it's going to be renewed. Anyway. Man vs. B. Mixed ratings for whatever reason. Netflix original series watch on Netflix. Rowan Atkinson. It's good. I don't know why Greg McHugh has been credited as the... I don't exactly know what he is. I'm just going to call him the, the grass cutter. Because that's all I've seen him do. Okay, we had the flamethrower as well. I've seen the first four episodes and it is good. Oh, I also seen the first three episodes of Miss Marvel. I've, I've caught up now. <clears throat> and then I can... Uh, you know, I'll, I'll be watching it as it comes out. Or on the Sunday of that week, you know. Unless something else happens, which... Fingers crossed it doesn't. So, it's last memory. Let's see if there's anyone I like. Billy Eilish. Nope. <clears throat> Paul McCartney. Eh, he... Okay, well, sorry, I like the uh, No Time to Die and Paul McCartney. I like Tom McGeller and Live It, Live and Let Die. It's like the third best Bond theme. <coughs> anyway, Kenny Gamar. Nope. Uh, that's all of these people. Um. I don't like Carly XCX. Don't like Doja Cat. In fact, I hate Doja Cat. Uh, Glass Animals is that. No, I'm thinking of Crystal Castles. Never mind. Don't know why she's supposed to. Um, Don't like Lord, don't like Megan B. Stallion. I'm surprised that the they you know that Noel Gallagher was allowed to come consider what he said about Harry Styles like that. It you know it must have been that no one heard him. Because what, what he said was definitely something that he that you'd get cancelled over. Okay, Olivia Rodrigo, I've only ever heard Good For You. Then again, most people have only ever listened to Good For You. As if she has a, another song. I don't know. But I like that song. I know of Phoebe Bridgers because she's good friends with Hayley Williams from Paramore, but I have never actually listened to any of her music. Now, would you look at that? No one I like is there. Well, sorry. Love you, Rodrigo, but I'm not counting her. Left my husband for the most hated man in America. You left for Trump? Why is Belle Delphine chatting? <laughs> what? I have a feeling that this is just going to be him fishing for likes, but yeah. Don't know why that is 
coming up in Bell Delphine. It's not a promoted tweet. It's not even a new tweet. A bit weird. Please don't copyright me. No, no, mm -mm. Why, why am I getting these? Like, What I've done, Ariana Grande's made a political statement. <clears throat> oh, no, actually, it's her birthday. I think she's 30 now. Let me look it up. She's not 30, but she's 29. Yep, 29. Why is Max Soldier in the lab film? It's because of the documentary that they. But HBO making up like Oh, Suicide Watch. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. When when the red guy or shell kill camera stops blinking. Okay, this is always gonna be Emma Wat Emma Watson saying I'm not coming back unless Oh no, it's anniversary of Hmm. That's two wars. You wanna say I'm part? For at least another eight years. Not happen. Okay. Well, Elmeo Corinthians four twenty sixty nine. Attack attacking random innocent women in the name of defending women. I'm. I'm guess. <laughs> so I'm guessing we have another incident like that guy who kicked the girl in the face. You know, the one that he's like, I, I meant to hit the camera. Like, an other incident like that. Yeah. Plus, I'd rather have my wife than you. You look like you have so many notches in the bedpost, you sleep on a pile of sawdust. And you're walking towards the 19th Amendment. I don't know when the 19th Amendment is. I'm going to have to look it up. Don't you just love it when you have an old phone and, you know, as soon as you get your new one, your old one breaks. I had, like, my, my old phone was very high percentage. Um, and I was going to, by the way, look what the 19th Amendment is, and, um, it just dies. It's not like it's high percentage. Anyway, oh, <laughs> um, I was having a bit of an argument with my uncle today, because I was, I was talking about how they're making a new Resident Evil, and uh, I was looking up who was in it. Lance Reddick is in it, playing Albert Wesker, which... I'm not a fan of the fact that they didn't cast someone who looks like Albert Wesker, but it's Lance Reddick. He, I think he'll do a good job. Um, like I was trying to explain to my uncle who Lance Reddick is, I, I said to him, the hotel manager from John Wick. He's like, the hotel manager from John Wick is white. Uh, and like we were arguing over it because. He was thinking of the guy that owns the hotel, like the owner, not the manager. The owner is Ian McShane's character. Uh, but, like he, he took my phone to try and look up who he was talking about. He, he looked up Deadwood Jedi because Ian McShane was in Deadwood. I just find that funny. Anyway, 19th Amendment. Uh, prohibits the United States and a state from denying the right to vote. The vote decision is just so the 19th Amendment is that women can vote. Anyway, you're an absolute idiot. Why? Please, you disgusting retard. Your wife will leave you soon, so karma will come. Reply to this DM, you soft bastard. I'll DM you every day. I hope while you're sleeping, your wife cuts off your dick. 
She probably will. You're a fraud and karma will catch up to you. Hey, sweetheart. Hit, hit the break the news to you, but overturning Roe v. Wade is completely unconstitutional. And it also probably wouldn't be a good idea to speak about God and the Bible with something that involves a law due to separation of church and state. You have no idea what you're doing. Have fun complaining about riots that, that you caused, and that's literally all you conservatives do. I just got paid it, didn't I? Go die, you fat bitch. Get your teeth fixed. That should be your priority. You deserve to be publicly executed. Jesus. In front of your family, you scumbag piece of crap. I have so many DMs to go through. People have been Googling you. Justice, thank you. And just over time, 22nd of June, 25th of June, woo! The fact that they think that there's actually a judge who, whose name is Dankula is shocking. Can't believe I know more about Scotus judges than the people who actually live in America. People had to actually check. I was the last one working on January 5th and forgot to lock the doors. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> I had to go on a state of the abortion laws and act that as a result of the Supreme Court's decision will not be recognized. But without abortion, they will now have more children in a drone strike. I <laughs> They would be happy. <coughs> you go by Count Dankula, do you think women will want to be within a 50 foot radius of you ever? I get hoes in different penal codes. Next order of court business, I decreed that my wife, daughter, and I shall go to the park and have, have fun and eat ice cream. The court's ruling is mandatory. With a flick. Of course, I'm not a barbarian. Enjoying the Scottish summer. Just out here passing laws while you're playing Fortnite. I hope the cause of that was made. Dallas women twerking for abortions. Shaking that ass so we can kill our babies. Probably to be a hoe and not to be a lady. You thought this would change my mind? Twerking is not illegal. Ding, ding, ding. Small deck energy in real time. Honestly, most women fake it, homie. Right. Whatever. Small deck, big gavel. You're a disgusting piece of human filth. Women in the, in the USA are being heavily oppressed. And you're joking about it? I can't believe you and other chuds can't admit that casual sex is not a normality and we women have a right to terminate as there is no possible al alternative. You have condoms and the pill and also vasectomies. What do you mean there's no alternative? Also, on top of those, like your partner could just pull out. What do you mean, no other alternative? Be used to prevent such a thing beforehand. The only way I will forgive you for your transgressions is a single picture of that mighty meat stump you have dangled between your legs. So we can do the right thing. Oh, sorry, I, I didn't know that it was a joke. That was in the first half, not gonna lie. Yeah, actually, it is. If you wore a mask for two years straight, you can wear a condom for the entirety 48 seconds that you're screwing. Then don't get pregnant. All of these tweets are. <laughs> they are all gone. And a uh, foo foo fee fee hun hun baguette to you too. I know it's cringe to be blocking people that. Like. I don't, I don't know why I blocked her. Forced pregnancy is a crime against humanity. 
Alexandria. Your partner has the ability to pull his pull his dick out of your vagina and finish, you know, somewhere that isn't inside of your vagina. On top of that, he also has the ability to wear a condom. You also have the ability to have the pill. And don't get pregnant. <clears throat> like, they're... I, s I swear to God, these are... At this point, I genuinely believe that you enjoy killing babies. Never even seen the Hamas Tale since it looks like some lame chick flick. I've seen the first episode. It's, it's, it's what you would expect, you know. Uh, women are oppressed. That's it. Like as for the actual plot, I think it's the this new party. Um, you know, like you have the Democrats and Republicans. It's a different party. They come up out of nowhere, and this actually seems quite similar to The Purge, but in the book, they've come out 28 years before The Purge was released, so. <clears throat> I'm just going to call this party the New Finding Followers of America, because that's the name of the party from The Purge. Um, but anyway, the, the New Finding Followers just pop out of nowhere and get really popular, and they, they come on the par, and now women are all handmaids and they're basically used for you know making babies cooking and cleaning that's it i don't know how you can turn that into a drama which has lasted however many seasons but i am going to watch the second episode because i am i need to do it for school now you're getting it You are the cum shot your white cracker mother should have swallowed. Cope plus sieve plus wear a condom. <clears throat> well, so you are, you're acknowledging that there are alternatives to, you know, coming inside. Then pregnancy isn't really forced, is it? Random white fat man speaking. What does the fact that he's white have to do with anything? What is this clip from uh, the e, e robot thing? Chatterbait. <laughs> Sorry, boys. Duty calls. Attention, ladies and gentlemen, we have a Category 3 hose mad alarm. I repeat, Category 3 hose mad alarm. This is not a drill. High levels of sodium chloride have been detected emanating from the thought community. I repeat, this is not a drill. All available troops, grab your memes, gifts, anime avatars, fire up the sock accounts and report to your stations. I repeat, this is not a drill. Some of you are going to get banned and not make it back alive. But that is a sacrifice I am willing to make. Hearts and minds? Fuck hearts and minds. We're not here to help. We're here to laugh. Prepare for salt drop on my mark. Three, two, one. March. Please do not copy strike me for that. It was like seven seconds of clip from aliens. Right, I, I get the entire thing. Well, was a clip from Aliens, but, like, the seven seconds for audio. Please don't copy strike me for that. Because you're going to copy strike me. Copy strike Sack and copy strike Mark. <clears throat> Which means you should listen. Right, what is the fact... I know I said this, but what is the fact that he's fat enough to do anything? Like, white, okay, we're always talking about race. But fat... Come on, this is a this an inclusive time. You cannot make fun of fat people, dickhead. 
I know it seems like I'm pissed off because I'm fat, but I'm not pissed off. I just don't get why. Like, the fat, the fat part, it's just, I don't understand that. <clears throat> Y'all are too comfortable threatening government officials. Mother's Day next year is going to be awkward. Breakfast in bed being thrown across the room because you can't go to the club. Then you shouldn't make decisions to need scientific facts. I don't need a fancy science degree. I watch Vsauce. And yet you're making decisions regarding women's bodies and lives. You don't get to choose what we do with our bodies. Hashtag abortion rights or human rights. Um, abortion rights or human rights. I mean, this is America we're talking about. They didn't sign the human rights treaty thing because they felt that the Constitution was a human rights treaty. Also, nowhere on that human rights treaty, or whatever you want to call it, does it say that abortions are a human right. I mean, you could argue that I think somewhere they'll say you, that you have a right to health care, but... Unless your life is in danger, then abortion is not healthcare. <clears throat> you can't do that with birth, without birth control, and even birth control isn't 100% effective. You want us to stop having sex even though it's human nature? Yeah. Stop being horny. You don't understand. I need to have sex with under. I need to have unprotected sex with strangers. Pops open, legs shut, simple as. Ever heard of rape, you absolute fat twat? We're not talking about rape, we're talking about you being a lazy bastard. Of course I have a working, <laughs> a working government 